Once you've identified some triggers, the next step is to consider which parts of you react strongly in these moments. Are there patterns of familiar feelings that arise, such as anger, fear, or sadness? These parts of us often hold on to past experiences and respond to present situations based on those memories. In IFS, we approach these reactive parts with curiosity rather than judgment. Instead of criticizing yourself for feeling a certain way, try to understand what these parts might be trying to tell you. What are their concerns, fears, or desires? How can you listen and understand their perspective without criticism? may be helpful to pause for a bit and consider